the most expensive part of your shopping? Right, so my idea is that you better get good at shopping for it. Hey, Joshua, can you get on all fours? Please. Oh, well, 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 no, no, no. You know, whether it's pig, lamb, a little rabbit, uh, pork, or a human, we're all roughly constructed the same way. If I'm touching the beef shin here, this is his shin there. If we go around to the sort of top side here, that's his thigh, right? And if you just put, touch the rump over there, Dave, right? That's, 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 that's his rump. The prime cuts are here because it's lazy because it hasn't got that sinew that kind of does all the hard work. The shoulders here, the neck, the, the buttocks and the shin, right? They're all the ones that carry in all the weight in the graft. Now, there's no real difference between quality. It's just some parts cook quickly and there's not much of them, so the price is up. And some parts are really tasty, but they need long and slow <laughs> cooking. If you know how to buy meat, it's going to taste what? Better. Better. If you know how to buy meat, you're going to save what? So You're all going to have a sirloin, right? We're going to hit it with salt on top, yeah. salt on the plate. We're going to hit it with pepper, lots of pepper. But steak likes pepper. We're going to go olive oil. Get this screaming hot, searingly hot. Preheat it for five minutes, right? This is the sinew here and the, the, the fat, right? We can encourage that by just press it down, right? And we just leave it there for a second, OK? Once that falls over, push it down so it, it really touches all the bars. And I do not want you to touch it until it's at about two minutes. We've got the rosemary stick here. Slice a little garlic here like that. It's looking good. See how it's bubbling? We rub it with garlic like that. That looks gorgeous. Clear up some of this fat and you just pat it on like that. And that will give it incredible flavour. Yeah. I'm going to teach you how to dress the board. Parsley, oh. right? Tiny bit of garlic. I want a little pinch of salt on it. You yeah. squash the garlic like that. Go olive oil. And a little bit of lemon juice, it's that sweet, sour. You want to get all those flavours going on in your mouth, even a little bit like that. And that's what the steak's going to rest on. When the steak comes off, we're going to dress the board, yeah? So we're going to just oh. move this around. What you're going to see is natural juices come out. I want you to slice it beautifully. I want it about just under a centimetre thick. I'm using the knife to carry oh, it. Oh, sweet as a nut. And just open it out on the plate like that. Here's the juice. Um, no, it it smells so nice and it looks so nice. He's a tease with his food. He knows we want it, so it makes us wait longer. Oh my god. Is that the best steak you've ever had? Jesus. And that's fairly standard beef that you'd get in any supermarket or market, okay? It's purely the method of cooking.